Hi there, I'm Tom Monroe, the Home Inspector. I'm on an inspection today of a house that's worth about four and a half to five million dollars in North Vancouver, British Columbia. And I'm standing in the master closet and I've uh, got to take you up to the attic space and show you an HRV system and talk about why it's important to actually have an HRV system that's installed properly, not like this one. Let me show you. So coming up the ladder, coming to the attic space, we've got the HRV system. Now, HRV systems should be conveniently located somewhere where we can actually maintain them and change the filters and wash the filters. HRVs are also supposed to be sized properly. This one here is 174 cubic feet per minute. Problem is, this home is 4,800 square feet. I'm gonna show the mathematical equation to properly determine what the BC building code requires for ventilation and why this one is so undersized. More importantly, when it comes to an HRV, you want to actually change and clean the filters. The door, I'll show you. I unbutton it here, unbutton it right there. And you see that the door, the filters are located behind it, up in there. Let's see maybe how dirty it is. It's hard to actually get a good shot. But the door has to open completely for me to actually get at the filters. Clearly, whoever installed this unit didn't realize that the thing needs to be maintained. Those filters need to be cleaned every three months, I say seasonally, so we know that they're properly filtering the air in the home. Unfortunately, whoever installed this unit did the world's worst job possible. So my apologies, I keep using the reference HRV throughout this whole video. HRV is a heat recovery ventilator and it's used to exchange all of the air inside with the, out, the air outside every hour or two hours, depending on if the home is an air conditioner and you're located in British Columbia. Unfortunately, the installer of this unit undersized the unit and put it in a location that the homeowners can't actually clean and maintain their filters. They're not gonna actually have any air movement because the filters are so clogged and they probably don't even know that they have to maintain this unit to start with. If you have any home related questions you'd like me to discuss, leave them in the comments below and let's figure them out. I post videos weekly. Don't forget to subscribe. Until next time, I'm Tom Monroe, the Home Inspector.